So Hogwarts Legacy is on the horizon and new details are dropping on the daily. Today I bring you confirmation on wand customization, Steam Deck compatibility, house sorting and some major news on the game from Avalanche and Warner Brothers themselves. First up guys, I can confirm Hogwarts Legacy will be compatible with the Steam Deck. A question put forth to Warner Brothers Game Support over on Twitter asked exactly this question. They replied with, greetings and thanks for reaching out to us. We can confirm for you that Hogwarts Legacy will be compatible with the Steam Deck. Now this is absolutely great, great news for all you Steam Deck players and fans out there. I've got a few pals who love the Steam Deck myself. They are hyped about this. Okay, so what about how sorting and how will it work in the game? Well, we got confirmation on this too. There will be a ceremony in the game, as you would imagine. We've seen this within the trailers too. But if you didn't know, websites are linked below. We have the Wizarding World, which if you link to the Warner Brothers game site, which is linked to your gamer tag. Put all three of these together, guys, on the Wizarding World website. You can actually go through the process of having the sorting hat pick a house for you, which is great and fun. This also works with the wand too, so you can have a custom wand picked for you. And again guys, if these things are linked with your gamer tag, these will transfer into the game when you play and create your wizard or witch. So you will have your house picked for you and you also have that custom wand, which is great, great news. But if you are unhappy with them and you want to change them in game, yes, this is an option. You can change house and you can also pick a different wand via ceremonies that will happen within the Hogwarts Legacy game. So that is absolutely great, great news too. And confirmation of this you'll see it on screen now. Firstly, the wand. Some guy asked about the wand and customization to it. They replied with, Hi Mike, thanks for reaching out about the wand customization. Players will be able to change their choice of wand during the wand ceremony later in game if you don't like your choice of the wand from the Harry Potter fan club quiz which is absolutely awesome. Also on screen now, seeing this about the house sorting. This is taken from the official Port Keys website. The question put forth is, will linking my Harry Potter fan club account carry over profile data such as my custom wand and Hogwarts house sorting? Now we just spoke about the wand, but here you can see they confirm about the house. While your sorted Hogwarts house will be your default choice in the game, you can choose to modify your selection before the end of the ceremony. So guys, in game when that ceremony happens, if you're unhappy being in Hufflepuff and want to change to Slytherin or Ravenclaw, as you would, you can. Pretty cool. Because that's exactly what I'm doing. Okay, so finally guys, and the final bit of news we have comes from a tweet from Warner Brothers Games France. They tweeted out in French, which I can't read. Luckily, there is a translator there. It states, hashtag Hogwarts Legacy. The Hogwarts Legacy has some good surprises in store for you. More information coming very soon indeed. Now, there's a lot of speculation on this tweet and what it could mean. It could mean a new gameplay trailer. It could mean a new gameplay reveal. I love a third reveal. I'm not going to lie. If that's going to happen, though, I'm not sure. It's a little close to release now. We've probably what two, three weeks to go. So yes, but when this news does drop people, I'll be sure to have you covered right here on my channel, whatever that news may be. But guys, if you did enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more Hogwarts, be sure to subscribe and hopefully guys, I will see you on that next one.